Hey everybody, this is Gino Green. Follow me on Twitter at the Gino Green. Here's your recap of the men's 2018 Big East Media Day from Madison Square Garden in New York City. Enjoy, guys. It always has been. It always will be. Those other leagues are going to come in and out, and that's good. I thought it was great. I thought, you know, we were last year. We were sold out. Barclays Center was sold out. It's just a great time in college basketball. So I, I, I welcome them as long as as long as Big E stays in Madison Square Garden. They they can do it whenever they want. Yeah, I, I would say I say I know that it's no exactly. It's ninety five percent of your man last year. You know, Joan wasn't as big, but um, for us last year, like the previous years before, was big. Like, it's huge for us. So we'll mix it. I'm not going to be too stubborn. They can't call for zone, type of thing. or we got to keep our I best like, players you know, on the floor. They got foul trouble, or the team doesn't like, miss. It's like, good at like, attacking zone. We'll definitely play zone as well. You know, we don't. We're really focused on being the best team we can be. We feel good about our team, we feel good about this experience which we haven't had that we have now. But we also understand we gotta go out there and make that happen. It doesn't happen by talking about it. Uh, me and my, 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 yeah, my gamer tag on the, on, the, on the game system is still cheese. Uh, all my guys call me cheese or yeah, so I mean, body wise. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I still love cheese. I have cheese on everything, so my my teammates still call me cheese. Do you feel you're in better shape when you got yeah, here? Yeah, way better shape. So I mean, um, Jason does a good job with us with the weight room. Um, every day we come in and lift. We got to take our body weight, so he knows what's going on. When we eating wrong, when we eating good, when we not eating. Jason knows. So, I mean, he's a good guy. It's my third year with him. I feel like this is the best my body's been ever. So, I mean, I'm going to keep following what he has for us and keep doing what I have to do to be successful. Do you want me to answer that as a player? Uh, you know, I think one of the, the strengths of our team is our, our depth and our balance and versatility. I think we have a, a really good mix of uh, veteran players who've won a lot of games in a market uniform and an influx of new guys that bring something different to the table. Uh, we've been a program that's... Uh, that's been very good on the offensive end. Uh, certainly our biggest room for improvement on the defensive end. Uh, but I like our guys' commitment and, and work to address that issue. So uh, hopefully we're a good all-around team and we can't be defined by, by one thing. How's that going to be, you know, especially with how it was last year with Providence in the fall? Um, I think that will be a fun game. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see. I uh, guess what our coach says when he's on the mic, you know, no, no breaks, but uh, it's going to be good. I think it's going to be a good game and it's going to be a good atmosphere. Right. And then upcoming this season, you guys are going to have a nice core back. You guys made the NCAA tournament last year. A few people expected you guys to after you first told them you left the year before. What's the expectations like around campus in Indianapolis? Um, expectations are always high, especially at Butler. Um, you know, we have our own expectations within our locker room and our, within our coaching staff. Uh, so we're just really excited to get it going and show all the hard work we've done. All right, good luck this season. Appreciate it.